a question or a big idea for grade 10 academic kids to explore or maybe even grade 10 applied if you like is to explore on a software like sketchpad is it always true that the midpoints on the sides of a quadrilateral can be always joined to make a parallelogram regardless of the shape of the quadrilateral so you can choose two opposite sides of that parallelogram and construct the slopes or at least co compute the slopes and they're the same they're both zero right now but that's okay that'll change but they're both equal that's the important point and then construct those uh, not construct but measure uh, the slopes of the those two opposite sides and you get the a and b c being the same they're the same slope so that's the condition for a parallelogram is when the slopes of the opposite sides are the same or at least you can get kids to agree with that on a prior lesson and you can see no matter where I move these four points it doesn't matter what I try to do with this no matter how hard I try to make this theory fail even for weird shapes like this one it's always it seems to be always true that you know arranging these four points make a parallelogram also you might you might also ask kids what do they also notice about when I move one point do all four slopes change and it seems to be not true that all four slopes change if you move one point two of the slopes seem to always be the same and two of them seem to always change which is another another generality another is it always true kind of question you could get the kids to explore too